Hey kids, what's up? Put down your things and put your heads up to the screen and make a green. This music in the air will stop on the drop. Sit back, relax, take your instrument, stop your beatbox. Turn your everything to the rhythm. It's music time. Oh, we gotta use notes, press, time signature to make a song and make it meaningful. Giddy up, hey, what are you waiting for? It's music time, let's go! Oh, we gotta use notes, press, time signature to make a song and make it meaningful. Giddy up, hey, what are you waiting for? It's music time, in one, two, three, go! Good day kids! Teacher GD here! Welcome to Music 6! Let's sing, let's have fun, let us have music on the run! I am here to introduce you to the wonderful world of music. Way back from your previous grades, you have learned that music is composed of different elements like rhythm, melody, harmony, texture, form, tempo, dynamics, and timbre. This time, you will be refreshed with an element of music which is rhythm, especially the different kinds and symbols of notes and rest, and of course, the value of each symbol. Expect activities that are full of fun, like clapping and stomping. As we sing and chant yells together with our friends, Oh, here they are, Karen and Mr. V. Hello, kids. Hi. We'll be joining the fun later. See you. Bye-bye. Sure thing, Miss Karen and Sir V. See you later. I am so excited now. You should too, because music in the air is about to drop in a form of singles. Are these familiar to you? If not, you don't have to worry. We will play a guessing game to remind you on what these things are. All you need to do is say the correct answer of each question after 5 seconds. Are you ready? First question. We use notes and rest to create a composition. Identify the encircled note in this musical composition. The choices are whole note, quarter note, eighth note, and half note. The answer is that's correct. Half note. How about this one? Notes and rest have time values. Which of the following notes receives one half of a beat? Dot and half note, eighth note, or quarter note? The answer is amazing! Eighth note. Next question. The rest represents silence in music. Which is quarter rest? These symbols are the following choices. Which one is the answer? Very good! This is indeed the correct answer. Which of the following dotted notes receives one and one half beats? These symbols are the choices. Which is the correct answer? That's right! It's this one! Now, for the last question. What kind of rest receives two beats? Whole rests, half rest, quarter rest, or eighth rest? The right answer is... Superb! It's half rest! Do you remember these symbols now? That's great! What do you call this? That's correct! Those are notes and rest. What are notes and rest? In music, notes are symbols for sound, while rest are symbols for silence. You can also say that note means sound 
and rest means silence. Each note and rest have the value that we call beats. The duration of sound or silence depends on each value of the beat. Let's take a look at this picture. In this chart, we can see the symbols and the values of both notes and rests. This is whole note, and this is whole rest. Their value is 4 beats. This is half note. This is half rest. And their value is 2 beats. This is quarter note. And this is quarter rest. Their value is 1 beat. This is 8th note. And this is 8th rest. Their value is 1 half beat. This is 16th note. And this is 16th rest. And their value is 1 fourth beat. This time, let us call our friends Karen and Mr. B to give us further explanation in a unique and fun way. Karen, Mr. B. Hello kids! We will be showing you how the beats are counted through dancing and playing music. That's right! So you better stand and do what I do. Let's do this! Since note means sound, we will clap our hands to represent it. And since rest means silence, we will shake our hips for it. Are we good about it? Great! Here we go! This is whole note. A note that has four beats. One clap, but four counts. That means that as we continue to count, the sound also continues. Like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. The next one is half note, which has two beats. One clap, but two counts. One, two, one, two. Do it with me. One, two, one, two. Then we have quarter note, which has one beat. One clap is one count. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Together now. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Eighth note, which has one half beat. This time, let us add a stomping to our clapping since the beat becomes quite fast. Like this. Stomp, clap, clap, clap. Stomp, clap, clap. Clap, stomp, clap, 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 stomp, clap, clap, clap. Everybody now. Stomp, clap, 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 stomp, clap, 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 stomp, clap, 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 stomp, clap, clap, clap. Let us make it even faster this time. We have the 16th note. Stomp, clap, 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 stomp, clap, 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 stomp, clap, 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 stomp, clap, clap, clap. Let's do it together. Stomp clap 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 stomp clap 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 stomp clap 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 stomp clap clap clap. This time, let's go to rest. This is whole rest, a rest that is four counts. Like this. One two three four. One two three four. One two three four. One two three four. Again. One two three four. One two. Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. The next one is half rest, which has two counts. Like this. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Do it with me. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Then we have quarter rest, which has one count. Like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. 
together now. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Eight rest, which has one half count, like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Everybody now. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's make it even faster this time. We have the sixteenth rest, like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's do it together. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Wow, that will do it. Bye for now. Are you enjoying so far? That's good to hear. Keep that excitement, cause there's more. The dotted notes and the dotted rests. The value of a dot is half the value of a note or rest it follows. A dot is commonly placed at the right side of a note or rest. These are the dotted notes and the dotted rests. A whole note or whole rest without a dot is only four beats. But since it has a dot, it becomes six beats. Same with dotted half note and rest, which is three beats. Dotted quarter note and rest, one and one half. Dotted eighth note and rest, three four. Dotted sixteenth note and rest, three eight. All right, let's wrap it all up. I clap my hands and stomp my feet. That's no, I do nothing, but I still count the beat. That's rest. We do it fast or make it slow. Just let your beat in your rhythm go with the flow. We just learn the things about rhythm. We learn the notes, rest, and the notes and rest. They have the beat, like stomping our feet. Let's all go now here, take your music in, notes and rest. Whoa! I think you're now ready for the quiz. You need to get your paper and a pen this time. Let's take a look at the chart. I'll give you three minutes to answer the following question. Read and understand each item carefully. Write the letter of the correct answer on your paper. You guys ready? Great! Let's start!
Time's up! Let's check your answers. These are the answers. Did you get a good score? Great! After this lesson, I want you to tell your parents or guardians to follow me on TikTok with this username at GD Crispo. I will be posting your assignment there. And also, follow and subscribe our YouTube channel, Beped TV, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. That's it for today, kids! Bye-bye!